Hi Libra, this is your weekly day by day. Tarot cards reading by Emma for the week beginning 5th of December 2022. So, we'll start immediately with the Monday, the 5th of December. So for you Libra, 7 of Swords. Tuesday, the Hermit. Wednesday, 3 of Pentacles. Thursday, 5 of Wands. Friday, 5 of Swords. 6 of Swords, Saturday. 8 of Wands, Sunday. The Chariot, your influencing energy. Alright, 7 of Swords, Monday. With 6 of Wands. The Hermit, Tuesday. With Page of Swords. Three of Pentacles Wednesday with Four of Pentacles. Five of Wands with the Chariot Thursday. Okay, Five of Swords with the Moon Friday. Six of Swords with the Empress. Eight of Wands with the Devil. Your influencing energy, Two of Swords, the Chariot. Look, you felt a bit insecure. Um, I don't know. Uh, unnecessarily perhaps because the chariot usually talks about your abilities okay being capable to achieve your goal okay now perhaps you did have your doubts for whatever reason you I don't know have you doubted yourself your knowledge your abilities maybe your timing or, or something or other people but you did have doubts okay movement with the chariot says yes you were just about to move one or another side but you didn't see which one is better or, or you couldn't even see that any of it is good enough for you you see what i'm saying kind of felt insecure yes movement opportunity new goals something was there yes you could achieve it you felt it you were capable okay to achieve whatever goals wherever that you're supposed to go whatever that you're supposed to do you felt capable it's only that you doubted purpose okay will it work for me doing it or not in that sense i really believe you felt a bit insecure last week but look a seven of swords and six of wands it, it's a change, definitely change of a mood. Um, another card, number seven. This is readiness to, okay, go after something, go after new goal, feeling capable to achieve it, feeling as a winner. You see what I'm saying? Very powerful energy. Number seven, waiting for go ahead and just to apply yourself. You will be the winner. You will achieve your goal. You will position yourself better, okay, into new routine, easier routine, more successful routine. You see what I'm saying? Something was, you know, possible out there. You doubted yourself or something. Definitely you doubted something. Definitely you were indecisive earlier. But seven of swords... Perhaps a brought some sort of decision. Okay, something was difficult. You dealt with something difficult out there. That's why you were insecure. You couldn't see this opportunity. You couldn't see these new goals because something else was on your mind and it was difficult, made you fearful. Now here on Monday, you are not fearing anymore. I mean, you're going to just leave it behind. I mean, whatever. I'm not going to trouble myself with this, with these problems, with these troubles. I'm not going to trouble myself. You will move on. You'll move on. This is winning energy. You've got your goal, something great, okay, you've got on your mind. Why would you dwell in this conflict, in these problems, in this something unnecessarily, okay? Just don't argue, don't discuss it, just leave it behind, okay? Quietly leave it behind. Go after something successful. Go after your goals. I kind of felt might be people around you because Seven of Swords is leaving this war zone. Perhaps you did have some sort of conflict with people, some sort of conflicting situation you dealt with, you were involved in and that's why you couldn't you know move on with something much more prosperous much better for you and on Monday perhaps you have just decided oh I'm not part of it anymore I'm going after something which is suitable for me uh, people might think that you are selfish maybe somebody will even point finger at you as selfish and you haven't done it correctly you have stolen it from us you see what i'm saying but you wouldn't care because it is but you wouldn't care because it was simply obstructing you okay forever nagging arguing or something you will decide no more 
No, the Hermit and Page of Souls on Tuesday. You might be having somebody, a Virgo person out there, but I kind of with the Hermit, I always see person I am reading for, I don't know why. I think it's your wisdom, it's your understanding, it's your knowledge, it's your hard work which you put up because of something. Could be that you have somebody out there advising you, somebody older, somebody with lots of knowledge, lots of experience, okay? Somebody who will give you good advice. This is very valuable advice on this day, will bring you clarity. Could be something like that, that is out of source and brings for you some sort of clarity. You were changing your mind, okay? Now you know for sure what you're supposed to do. You did have some sort of presumption, some sort of idea, what would be the best way. But now, since you've got this truthful information, truthful advice, or simply your work out, okay? you understood, you got answer for these questions, okay, and brought you clarity, and now you understand, it's not what you presumed, it's not what you thought about it, it is this what you've got here on this day, it is this what you understand here on Tuesday, okay, I hope you understood me. It is change of mind because now you got truth, now you got understanding and perhaps you work it out by yourself, okay? This is alone, being alone, work it out by yourself or you did have somebody like work or person out there, somebody older living by themselves, a very wise uh, person advised you, okay? And changed your mind, you are not presuming anymore, now you know, in that sense, perhaps your Tuesday. Your Wednesday with the three and the four of pentacles. Look, three of pentacles is lovely energy, is something which begins to build and you are loving it and you are looking forward to do it and you're looking forward to develop with that one. Maybe your, I don't know, skill that you begin to develop. Now you are loving it, you would love to expand with this skill. This skill can maybe bring you money or so. Maybe it's about building, okay, literally building something around your home. Um, decorating, painting, fixing something, you see what I'm saying? Maybe it's um, your employment and this is first money you are receiving, maybe your new employment or your new business. Something which was like hobby to you, something very enjoyable, begins to bring money. Now this is very promising, um, something for your future, does have something for your future. At this point is not much, okay? This isn't much, but is solid, okay? From this point, you can grow, you can develop. It is important for you to have it, okay? This is, I'm having it, it's mine, okay? I worked for that. This is my money, this is my property, my business, this is my knowledge, this is my independence. Something is yours, okay? And you don't want to share with others. This is not sharing, okay? Even perhaps we do have people around who were admiring that what you have, that what you received, that what you do, but you will not share with others. You will do it by yourself because it is just yours. Money which is supposed to come will be just yours. You see what I'm saying? Even though it's not much, this isn't much, but you want it because it is first stability perhaps for you and you consider it yours and just yours. In that sense, this Wednesday. No, Thursday with five of wands and the chariot. The chariot energy present this week from earlier on influencing you this week. Coming back on Thursday, lovely energy of the winner. It tells me that you all the time, even from earlier on, you do have opportunity for something, okay? Very prosperous. This is your goal. There is down there some you know, some something which you want, something, some rewards out there, some money, some project to be done, and there is reward, there's money, there's success for you. You see what I'm saying? You are completely ready for it, to do it. You've got your knowledge, you've got everything. The chariot is a well-trained competitor. You've got your but you've got yourself prepared, okay? You can go for it. But now with five of wands, it seems to me some sort of chaos appears out there. I really believe it's other people. I don't know, being insecure, wanting to get involved in that what you do. I kind of sense other people that you all the time want to avoid somebody. You want to do it by yourself, you feel yourself capable, you can make it by yourself, you can make your money um, and it will be yours. You want it to be just yours. You 
feel capable to do it by yourself. But now again, we have people here on Thursday perhaps fighting for their rights to do it, you know, and, and they are bringing confusion. In fact, they are not bringing harmony. They are not helping. They're not helping you at all. You are capable yourself and people are bringing chaos, bringing misunderstandings, bringing fights and confusion out there. I mean, you will perhaps wait for things to die down um, and, and then you can do it by yourself. It, my impression is all the time that you don't want to do something with these people. You want to do it by yourself. Um, again, people, okay, here with the Five of Swords, people who were blaming you that you took something which they also wanted, okay, uh, they competed for the very same thing, but you won, you got it. You will not celebrate on this day because you will consider it partial success. I mean, you just cannot celebrate. People mean around, the feeling as a losers. I mean, you just cannot say, oh, I won, hip hip hooray. No, you will not, but you won. You know, technically, here on Friday, you've got it. What you needed, really, for yourself, you want it, you've got it. Other people won't be happy, not at all, okay, absolutely. They will be disappointed. You, with the, with the moon energy, you won't react. I mean, I, I really believe that you will pull back. You won't say sorry, you won't apologize. You will just wait for things to die down, to for you to emerge on another side, just to pass this day, okay? Just to sleep it over will be better from tomorrow. I really believe this Friday is like that and it is a bit, really a bit better from tomorrow, from Saturday. Six of Swords, from five into Six of Swords, it is a bit easier, okay, on this day, no more fights, okay, they, they people will accept. It is what it is. You won. It's yours. You were off to go. Um, you were not happy here. This isn't happy energy, but it's going towards happier times. A movement here. At least you are turning back to these conflicts, to these arguments. You see what I'm saying? That was so important for you. All right. To just finally move away. Not to have this worries, these conflicts, these words, these troubles, you don't want it in your life anymore. And finally on Saturday, you feel, oh, it's easier. Stress level is going down on this day, on Saturday, and you are with the Empress energy. You're just enjoying the moment. Okay, this is very quiet, very lovely moment. You've got what you wanted. You are enjoying this money, this some sort of success, something you wanted. Okay, you wanted your rights to compete in this race, to have this job, to have this uh, project for yourself. You didn't want. You didn't want to share it with other people. You wanted to do it by yourself. Okay, and to get all the money for yourself. You see what I'm saying? You felt capable to do it by yourself. In fact, people would perhaps just spoil the fun, will perhaps just bother you, just would perhaps just make it difficult, more difficult than if you do it just by yourself. In that sense, I felt that this relationship between you and others, um, others is just nuisance here this week for you and you finally manage by Saturday to get rid of them and you feel good about yourself because it's easy, it's really easy on this day. It was stressful, Thursday, Friday particularly. Eight of Wands and the Devil. Now, Eight of Wands, energy of communication, preparation, something which is in the air, okay, preparing, talking, negotiating, you see what I'm saying, something like that, intense energy, I love eight of wands, never see uh, this card negative, always expands, this is something you do uh, because you want to do it, because it will create something meaningful for you, it, it will bring some growth, as soon as you complete it, as, you, as soon as you finish all these preparations, talks, communications, the negotiations that will land on the ground something and will begin to grow you see what i'm saying so whatever effort that you need to put on this day even if it's sunday okay you will do it you will attend it okay um with the devil within you you will perhaps 
try maybe to delegate, to ask your children, your friends to do something for you. Maybe you're going to ask your friend in municipality or in this office, government office, to uh, do something through the back door so you don't have to stand in the queue. You see what I'm saying? The devil's energy looking for this little bit of manipulation, some shortcuts, something. You see what I'm saying? So you don't, so you don't have to you know, sweat much on it. You will do it, you know, all of it. This is very important to be done in the perfect order. And you're not gonna give up. You are only looking for easier way, looking for connections for your friend's cousin down there in the office to do things for you so you don't have to, as I said, stand in the queue or I don't know, you don't have to something. <laughs> because it's the devil always manipulative a little bit. But anyway, not bad week in general, okay, you will be successful, though you will have a little bit of problem with people around you. Anyway, Libra, enjoy your week.